Inakuwa jo tuwa nguvu, minito vizenta ali, your entertainment PA, the A is always for amazing. Thank you for the love, thank you for the support, mbo mna wanyesha siku zote, tunapuachia videos zetu. Niko mainio ya rongai sehemu mbo inaitua kandisi, na nimekuja hapa kwa ajili ya kupiga story na wana mbo walizindua kitu mbo chonicha ajabu sana. For you to ever think kwa mba kuneza kukakua na resort, ya ni katikati ya sehemu hivi, ambayo ni kama msitu yani sitaki nizungumze sana nataka wewe e, ujionee mambo mengi ni ajabu kwangu tu kama itakavukua ajabu kwako nataka tuingie maeneo ambayo inaitwa Blue Gum Resort tuweze kupiga story na watu mbo wana on this place tuweze kujua tu e, inakaaje na ni vitu vipi ambavyo viko ndani because it's a very very unique place niaje fiti fiti wanakuita nani mimi naitwa Robert Morioki uh -huh. i am one of the owners yeah. and uh, Karibu ni Blue Gum Resort. Yeah. And yeah, nataka tu kabla tu tupige tu nikulize tu maswali mawili matatu. I just want to know uh, ilikuwaje uh, kuanzia mki plan kutengeneza hii Blue Gum Resort? Mlianza vipi? Kuanzia hii Blue Gum mm -hmm. ilianza kama mchezo. Mm -hmm. So ilianza tukiwa tunasema tunataka kuanza kufanya farming mm -hmm. ya samaki na kuku. Mm -hmm. So vile tulikuwa tunaenda kufanya research yetu ya hizo Mm -hmm. tukasema lazima tuweke kwanza nyumba yetu mm -hmm. tujue vile tutaweza kuishi huko yeah so we started with we wanted to put the container homes mm -hmm. so tuka change your plan mm -hmm. tukasema acha tuweke uh, cottages so mm -hmm. my mom had this dream that she should put cottages here mm -hmm. so ikaanza hivyo kama mchezo tu mm -hmm. akaanzisha safari september mm -hmm. ya kuanza kujenga um, cottages that was last year yeah last year mm -hmm. And unfortunately, that time I was not in the country. Mm -hmm. So I was actually in Malaysia. I was studying there. Mm -hmm. I was doing animation. Mm -hmm. So I was in the country. I was in the country all the time. Yeah. I was the progress. I was in the country. Mm -hmm. And in December, I was in the country. I was in the country. I was in the country. Why aren't you doing this mm -hmm. as a full thing? Why not just add more rooms? I was in the country. I was in the country. I was in the country. At least I was in the country. I was in Kambia, in fact, that's a good idea. Mm -hmm. We thought about it. Mm -hmm. So to can save you. Mm -hmm. Then <laughs> in January, we now started more building more and more and more. Wow. Yes. This is very amazing. Uh, I'm really excited. Kweza kupiga tuwa na wewe. Tuwa na iko vipi kwa sababu. Kwanza, the first thing ambayo mtu wana notice. You know, when you enter here. Yes. Ni kumba. Unanikana kumba, miti ni mingi sana. Idea ilikuwa ya kupanda miti, ama ilikuwa ilia nini? So, this farm tumekuwa na for a very long time. Mm -hmm. So, tumekuwa tukifanya, actually, hizi miti tulizipanda 206. Yeah. So, they've been here, we've always been harvesting them, mm -hmm. tukizi user. Mm -hmm. Then, sasa vile tulianza hii journey ya ku and the easy cottages mm -hmm. tukasema tu za zikata mm -hmm. tunataka pia watu wakikuja hapa wapate ile feel ya nature yeah. wa enjoy hiyo freedom ya kuwa na mamiti na manini mm -hmm. na wa enjoy time yao yeah. yes so okay. that's how you can see now the trees, the trees yeah <laughs> so twende hivi twinge yeah, hivi twende hivi mhm mm okay sasa nitaweza kuambia one or two things yeah, no, na hii ndio kwa rooms residence rooms, eh? residence bar and restaurant so this is this is the re the reception mm -hmm. and the office okay so ukikuja hapa mm -hmm. the first thing ukiingia kwa gate mm -hmm. ukisikia unataka kulala ama ukitaka kuzungusha utakuja tu hapa kwa reception mm -hmm. usalime mwenye atakuwa hapo mm -hmm. akukaribisha vizuri ukunyoka juice ukunyoka nini mm -hmm. ukiendelea na kasafari kako ya kuona blue gum kuona blue gum venye iko yeah and uh, pale mbele yetu kuna kuna the first the cottage. first cottage eh? hii ndio ilikuwa inception mm -hmm. cottage sorry sorry uh -huh. so we started with this mm -hmm. so this is kind of for the meantime it is uh, privately for our family yeah but in the long term we'll be renting it out. this yeah. out for uh, families uh -huh. people who have like um big <laughs> groups because yeah. it's it's fully <laughs> fully decked out so it has two beds kitchen bathroom and all that yeah hii ndo mnasema kwamba mlikuwa mmeitengeneza kama yenu tu ya kutulia ile kutulia tukifanya family yetu hapa and all that so tukaiweka hii ya kwanza watu kuiona wakaipenda and and pia naona mmeweka inaitwaje hizi kwenye the handrails you know we put this cuz naturally we have black cotton yeah and black cotton is very very bad when it's wet yeah ina kuanga very sticky watu walikuwa na chavia tu huko yeah kukinyesha kukinyesha yeah so we were like you know what this is too much we need to put maram and these but at least hata mtu akiwa amelemea kidogo akiwa ametoka pande ile 
atajishikilia polepole pole kiletwa na mtu <laughs> oh ndo asianguke ndo asianguke ndo hiyo yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. this is very beautiful so this is you get this um kind of on veranda mm-hmm. you know in the morning when you just want to wake up get mm-hmm. out have your book out or your phone mm-hmm. check your emails mm-hmm. what not you just sit out here mm-hmm. you enjoy that cup breeze that cup morning bad sounds wow. eh <laughs> nothing else disturbing you mm-hmm. Then you can go inside. Mm-hmm. This is what you get. You get a simple enough bed. Yeah. Uh, you have your s- small coffees, teas, yeah. and all that. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And then we have the shower and the toilet on the other side, which is too high, I guess. <laughs> yeah, I want to know what to do. How easy was it actually to build kama hii for example kwa sababu kwanza mm-hmm. naona mmetumia uh, wood yes. na pia mmetumia simiti yes. yeah was it ilikuwa ngumu ama ilikuwa ilikuwa rahisi um it's no, i won't say it's hard and i won't say it's easy mm-hmm. i'd say it's in the middle mm-hmm. the thing that we wanted to consider was that feel of nature mm-hmm. you don't want to put something that is so modern so yeah. what so we did it basically as um minimalistic as possible yeah. but at the same time to keep our clients as safe as possible mm-hmm. and as comfortable as possible mm-hmm. so at ukangala hii roof ikona he this is cement yeah. then it has um gunia gunia then it has mabati uh-huh. then makuti at wow. the top wow. yeah does that does, does that mean kwamba you know usiku issue ya baridi haizi kwa shida no 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 baridi kabisa uh-huh. hakuna baridi uh-huh. right now you can feel it's cool yeah. so the thing we like about this house is during the day you don't get that heat yes. and all annoying things that yeah. wake you up in the morning you know mm-hmm. you'll be very comfortable inside this mm-hmm. nini cottages yeah. very comfortable very cool very calm mm-hmm. at night it's a bit warmer mm-hmm. so yeah you get to enjoy. <laughs> wow, this is amazing. Let's uh, twende hivi kidogo <laughs> tuone the next one pengine yes. because there are actually many lakini hatutaangalia mm. zote. zote. We'll just look at them because sababu I feel like kuna hii ambayo imejengwa vizuri yes. na kama nyumba and then now there is the there is actually the tent one yes, ambayo yes, ningependa yes. pia watu waione. Na enjoy. yeah. And being here it actually gives you a Masai Mara vibe. Eh? Mm. You know ni kama uko Masai Mara ni kama uko uko mahali kule msituni. Yes. Eh, Eh unasema kwamba before pia mlikuwa mnajaribu kufanya eh, kufanya farming si ndio mm, lakini mm. haiku go through do mm. you guys ever regret mnasema ai mbona hii biashara haiku go through no 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 we don't regret in mm-hmm. fact we thank god that we got this idea mm-hmm. and we did this instead of the farming because mm-hmm. farming ingekuwa tu sisi peke yetu mm-hmm. we wouldn't have been able to share all this nature with mm-hmm. people yeah. it would have been very hard maybe only our close friends people we know mm-hmm. would have been allowing them to come in mm-hmm. but then now we're giving access to anyone who wants to come and wow. enjoy this nature mm-hmm. for for a price hebu <laughs> tuangalie <laughs> hii kwanza before we actually talk about the price unajua watu wakisikiaga price wanajiuliza eh hii price kweli ni affordable <laughs> okay mm-hmm. Let us look at the tent okay. and, and 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 examine it and then now when we go back up I'll explain on the prices. Okay, okay. this is very amazing. Yeah. The wooden floor. Yes. I, wooden I'd floor. say it's a plus. Yeah. Iko vizuri sana. Direct sababu njoo tuangalie huko ndani. Sababu there are the this the washrooms, kuna bafu hapa, kuna eh. This is very amazing. Yes. Ila tu ni ni ulize ideally Mm-hmm. sehemu kama hii yes. sehemu kama hii yes. inafaa kuwa na occupants kama wangapi ambao tuseme kama mimi nataka kuja mm-hmm. tusikuje zaidi ya wangapi kwa, kwa na tunataka kuchukua nyumba moja mko tu wawili tuko tu wawili yes mm-hmm. per room we allow only two people mm-hmm. uh, safety reasons mm-hmm. fire hazards also mm-hmm. and also for your own comfort mm-hmm. and enjoyment because wow. if you're past two mm-hmm. uh, you might not really enjoy the experience you mm-hmm. feel you're a bit cramped up mm-hmm. yeah so say say in total let's say mm-hmm. uh, cottages same as kupumzika za kulala ni kama ngapi we have um, two to three cottages mm-hmm. and we have two to three tents wow. and we still have the normal camping tents mm-hmm. that if you feel this is a bit too pricey for you mm-hmm. you can take the normal tents that are a bit more priced down mm-hmm. and then you get now the pure camping experience yes. ile you know yes. Masai Mara vibes that you nasema mtu mnafukuzana na Simba huko tutakuwekea sound effects nice one nice one nataka tuzunguke tuendelee kupiga lap eh? but yes. there's also one thing ambayo uh, nice kwamba mm. eh, mtazamaji mm-hmm. anafaa ajue mm-hmm. na ukija huku mm-hmm. 
uh, security yako iko vipi it is very secure uh-huh. we have um, security guards 24/7 mm-hmm. uh, we have people patrolling mm-hmm. and also um, uh-huh. even our rooms uh-huh. are very the doors are very hardened yeah so we made sure that you being here you're mm-hmm. very secure mm-hmm. the whole fence is secured mm-hmm. it is locked mm-hmm. it is electrified mm-hmm. so hata mtu kujaribu kuvuka atakula customer ama atakula glass atachagua yenye anataka eh kama ni stima akule stima kama ni glass atakula glass what are some of the activities ambazo nyi mkiangalia eh kwenye kwenye plans zenu yes, mna yes, plan yes. ambazo zitakuwa zitakuwa uh, zina happen here at Blugam um, so so far we've talked with a few people mm-hmm. and we are trying to get paintballing here mm-hmm. so we're trying to get at least competitions for paintballing to be brought here yeah. oh, okay. we're brought with um, also team activities so if you want to come with your groups mm-hmm. you can kind of uh, come in do your own barbecue mm-hmm. outside barbecuing mm-hmm. outside what yeah you know it basically our all the activities we want is mm-hmm. family oriented mm-hmm. so that if you can come with your family enjoy time here yeah perfect uh, is, are these the tents yes. so these are the tents i was talking about if you want to do the camping camping mm-hmm. so they won't be at this position exactly mm-hmm. so if you come and you don't see them in this position mm-hmm. don't mind zitapeleka kule ndani kule ndani so that you get the actual experience so that you feel enyo niko niko, niko in the wild niko in the wild yes wow and sasa mtu anaweza kaa pia ajiulize nimekuja nimekaa huku nitakula wapi and ah, upande sasa. wa kukula sababu hapa nimeona kuna bar yes, and restaurant <laughs> eh, i'm very excited <laughs> kujua eh, Uh, ni what are some of the foods ambazo pengine mnasema kwamba ah sisi ukikuja mm. tunakupepea mm. hii na hii na hii so uh, my mother being my mother mm-hmm. <laughs> and being a very generous woman and very catering woman yeah. she was like you know what no mm-hmm. hotel has no restaurant mm-hmm. so mm-hmm. she said let's sit down think of a small thing mm-hmm. that we can do mm-hmm. so we thought about african dishes because wow. so clearly we're in the nature mm-hmm. and we want to bring this africanness alive mm-hmm. so we said let's build a nice bar nice restaurant where we can cater for the guests who come and sleep here mm-hmm. and they can have a good time yeah yeah <laughs> so we kind of did that okay yeah. tell us about this all right this right here <laughs> what you're seeing mm-hmm. it's going to be just a uh, hiring grounds. Yes. So if you want to come do team building, mm-hmm. if you want to come do your wedding, mm-hmm. it's not going to look like this. It's going to look better, trust yeah, me. Yeah. In a few months, mm-hmm. we just started growing the grass. Yeah. So in a very few months it's going to look very beautiful. Na iko na ka history flying. Iko na ka history. Iko na ka history. But the history mm-hmm. is that uh, we spent our money mm-hmm. doing it. Mm-hmm. And uh, being that this is black cotton, <laughs> The sun decided to do a good number on us uh-huh. and burn our grass. Wow. <laughs> so we had to <laughs> kind of level it out uh-huh. and burn the grass that we planted yeah. and then now we have to do a layer of red soil. Yeah. Wow. Uh sehemu kama hizi. Hizi uh-huh. zinatumika so kufanya all nini? Uh-huh. It's going to be sitting area uh-huh. in the near future. Uh-huh. We're adding more chairs, we're yeah. adding in more tents, uh-huh. you know the sitting tents. Uh-huh. Yeah, those ones. Wow. This so is we have plans to add on so we're just in our starting stages mm-hmm. but um, we're going to keep doing it every day yeah yeah naona pia pale kando kuna sehemu ya kuchoma nyama yes. tuko na crematory ya meat mm-hmm. where we make delicious and very tasty nyama choma mm-hmm. so when you come here mm-hmm. please make sure you taste it make sure you taste good. the nyama choma yeah. now let's get tuingie ndani kidogo tuingie ndani kidogo tuone hii sehemu ambayo inaka very amazing yes eh hey, inaka vizuri sana Asante, asante. So, nyinyi mnataka ku, kuifanya ikuwe, ikuwe kama nature. Is that why yes. mefanya, mbao sana yes. sana? Yes, yes, wow, yes. It's very so, amazing. The first place is this is the bar. Uh-huh. So this is the bar. So if you look at it, uh-huh. it looks like a container uh-huh. and that is because it's a container. Okay. Not a natural container, uh-huh. but um more of a artificially made by us container. Okay. There are these mabatis mekuja, uh-huh. they're double layered. Uh-huh. And then in the middle is gonna chuma. Yeah. So we use that to do this whole thing. Okay. So as you can see, we stuck to pallets. Mm-hmm. We've been but this whole build is supported by pallets. Okay. We've not used wood wood. We've used pallets. We're trying to recycle as much as possible. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So that's why you have this beautiful after finish with which is just made out of wood that 
might have just been burnt. <laughs> yeah. So kwa mtu ambaye amekuja, amepata sehemu ya kulala, ashapata yeah. kitu ya kukunywa, zakaa huko ama pale. Mm-hmm. Twende sasa my sasa favorite next, place. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> It's a place where mm-hmm. dreams are made. Dreams are made. And mouths are left full uh-huh. of taste and wow. enjoyment. Wow. Yeah. Naona. Yeah. Yes. This and is the kitchen see, area? Yeah, this is the kitchen. Mm-hmm. Those are our chefs back yeah. there trying to hide. I don't know why they're hiding. <laughs> <laughs> so this is our head chef. Mm-hmm. He's called Hannington. Yeah. Yes. Okay, this is amazing. This is amazing. Yes. Yes. And w- one thing I actually love about this uh, mm-hmm. kitchen mm-hmm. is the fact that it's very it's sparkly clean. Unajua mm-hmm. usafi ni kitu muhimu sana when it comes to maeneo ya jikoni. Yes, yes, yes. pia hapa juu I think naona kangazi. Let's let's kangazi. explore. Tu, yes. Tuone kuna nini huko juu. We explore we know. Mhm. Mhm. <laughs> So uh what is up there kabla tufike to surprise kabla us? Tufike, uh-huh. I think I don't want to hide um or I don't want to spoil the surprise. Uh-huh. So uh, we call it the gate to heaven because it's ah. kind of <laughs> <laughs> Hey, so nice one. Uh-huh. You end up getting a very amazing view uh-huh. and a very amazing setup uh-huh. up here. Wow. Yeah. Wow. This is very amazing. Ash, Ash, this is very nice. Thank Any you, chill spot, eh? This is the chill spot. Mm-hmm. And later <laughs> on, this is the uh, VIP. <laughs> or if you want to do your birthday or an event, mm-hmm. chama, mm-hmm. um you can hire. Yeah, you can hire this oh. space out. Yes. Nice. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And It's then we still have more. Eh, lakini kabla tufike huku, nataka tu kujua when when let's say nimekuja hapa, niko na nyumba pale na familia yangu, let's say Um, ni kuna access ya his spe- his space fully fully you have access to anything and everything mm-hmm. in this compound oh. so if you want to go sit in the garden there mm-hmm. you have access mm-hmm. you want to go sit in the middle of the trees here mm-hmm. you have access wow whatever your heart desires when you are here mm-hmm. you'll get it fulfilled as long as it's nothing illegal <laughs> looking at this place you know miti peke yake yes. the land itself yes it must have costed a lot Yes, it costed a good shilling. <laughs> <laughs> it costed a good shilling. Mm-hmm. Yes. Kiyo, kiyo go go go. Go story. No problem. Naweza kuja tukae tu hapa. Okay. Si ndio. Hizi zimetengenezwa nani? Uh so this mm-hmm. inside is hay. Mm. Then we wrapped it with a to yeah. protect it. Yeah. And then we just put this um kikoi mm-hmm. on top. Yeah. yeah. Now looking at this vi- business mm-hmm. and uh, the way it's going and the way you guys mkona pia plans za ku you know expand na ku add more facilities in yes, the future. Yes, yes, yes. Are you guys looking at you know probably opening another one? <laughs> um let's say this uh-huh. we're not going to close our ideas to that. Mm-hmm. We still have lots of land mm-hmm. and uh, we still have lots of ideas to capture. Mm-hmm. So oh. maybe we'll come to a town near you and yeah. open something new. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh-huh. So actually for here mm-hmm. we want this to become even bigger. So we still have to build our swimming pool. Mm-hmm. We still have to do a bit of swings for children wow. so that when families come mm-hmm. they can enjoy. Mm-hmm. They can have time with their kids. They know when daddy and mommy are here having like, uh, something something mm-hmm. they know their kid is out there having yeah. fun and they're secure they're safe they're in good hands yeah yeah now this is is it mainly made for the local tourists ama pia even the international tourists they can come here and you know have a good time oh yeah i'll say this mm-hmm. we've had already international <laughs> guests yes. so yes. we've had <laughs> guests from america mm-hmm. we've had guests from switzerland mm-hmm. we've had guests from france mm-hmm. we've had guests from uh, belgium mm-hmm. so they've been coming so this is open to anyone mm-hmm. we're not locking anyone out mm-hmm. even if you're coming from tanzania even if you're coming yeah. from kibera you come even if you see. live just here in Rungai. yeah mm-hmm. you come mm-hmm. you know you're told Uh, when you get you too used to your bed mm-hmm. even your bed gets bored of you <laughs> but then when you come out mm-hmm. and sleep on a new bed, mm-hmm. your bed by the time we, yeah it will miss you it will be like hey come back <laughs> come back yeah. Yeah. so you come you refresh your back at least atam gongo you skie a new mattress mm-hmm. your head gets this uh, serenity mm-hmm. and peacefulness mm-hmm. And yeah you go back home and you feel fresh and even when you see your home you'll be like oh my god my house is actually this beautiful yeah, amazing <laughs> yeah. yeah i just want to know kwa siku ambayo let's say for example uh, a time when you know there was have you guys ever been overbooked you know watu wanapiga simu na wambia ah sasa tukubooked funny story uh-huh. we've only been open for a month okay a month and uh, five days mm-hmm. 
and there was a week we were so overwhelmed with bookings mm-hmm. we were like ama do we just get to sheds <laughs> we just put people <laughs> under them yeah. but yeah we thank god that um he's been able to be faithful to us mm-hmm. and he's given us such a good start mm-hmm. and uh this is a promise to our guests mm-hmm. we're sorry we let you down the first time yeah. next time we'll have more rooms we're actually in the plans of making more rooms mm-hmm. yeah ah this is very amazing personally ni maipenda lakini mm-hmm. tu tukimalizia mm-hmm. what do you say is your favorite ka spot now you as you wachana sasa na kutuambia kuja hapa kuja hapa mm-hmm. which one would you say hey aka ka spot i just love being here um i'd say where we are right now mm-hmm. cuz you get um i wish the streets were in that tall mm-hmm. but there's a time you could get the views of ngong hills mm-hmm. and then you're just surrounded by the hills and you get that breeze mm-hmm. and then you, your mind here will just it just disappears and just yeah. relaxes yeah. and you just go one with nature mm-hmm. even if you let's say you come have your soda your if you're someone who likes alcoholic prev- yeah. beverages mm-hmm. You will enjoy this peaceness. Mm-hmm. I have I have customers who come mm-hmm. just to sit here. Just to sit. Just to sit. Just to sit. And I just tell them, "Okay, come. <laughs> just come, yeah. sit, enjoy." <laughs> wow. This is amazing. Uh come to Mbaya na plan, you know, kukuja hapa. Yeah. Is there something that some things and you guys say that of course we allow you to come, of course we allow you to come and have a good time, mm. but don't do this, don't do that, don't do that. Okay. So as I said, mm-hmm. uh, we allow almost anything mm-hmm. for you to do as long as it is very legal. Okay. So we go one one with the law. Okay. As you've seen when you're driving here, we're very close to a police station. Yes. yes. <laughs> so anything you do illegal, trust mm-hmm. us, you mm-hmm. will end up there. Yeah. So anything to do with drugs, anything to do with violence, mm-hmm. we don't condone it at all. Mm-hmm. We don't condone such behaviors here. Mm-hmm. Um things with um prostitution money laundering yeah. same case yeah. it goes down the same wow. case yeah amazing nimekuwa nikipiga story na jamaa mbaya amenipa bonge la exclusive tour ya same ambayo inaitwa Blue Gum Resort if you didn't have a reason to come here now you have one kama pia ulikuwa una uko 50-50 sijui niende sijui nisiende ama ulikuwa unajiuliza utaenda wapi i do believe kwamba this is a good place mimi nitakuja by the way i will come thank you in ni sabe tu either huu mwezi ama next month tutafuta siku tu moja ama mbili ya kupumzika lakini umesema bei iko sawa bei iko sawa kabisa yeah. watu wasiogope wasiogope kabisa 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 wow amazing sana thank you very much thank uh, you. just talk to the people just tell them anything ambayo una feel pengine i've left it out just talk to them <laughs> even if it's telling them to come yeah. location iko wapi yeah, yeah. ukiwa rongai town how do you get here okay so mm-hmm. For us we are located in Kandisi area. Mm-hmm. That is um if you remember Ambassador Maura. Mhm. Mdaura. Mdaura, Mdaura, yeah. He lives just down the road. Okay. Up to date he still lives there. Wow. So we are close to his house. So mm-hmm. you just continue with the road. Mm-hmm. We have access to an SGR station. Mm-hmm. So we are on the Suswa line. Mm-hmm. So if you're coming from Mombasa or wherever, mm-hmm. you can just jump on the train mm-hmm. that that's going to Suswa and it will drop you off at our area. Mm-hmm. We'll pick you up. Mm-hmm. And if you're coming from town area, if you're driving, mm-hmm. uh we're at the town of Atrimpa. Mm-hmm. So you turn in Atrimpa, mm-hmm. then continue straight down past the police station, then turn on your right again. Okay. Yes. Now when you're to land, when you're to land, Onye muna land uh-huh. tutawatengenezea helipad. Si ndio. Yes. Na jet mta, 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 <laughs> we'll do something. We'll do something. Yeah. Uh, thank you very much tupatie namba yako tukimalizia. Yeah. Not yako ex- usipatie ile yako tupatie ya kazi. Tutakupatia yeah. <laughs> kazi. Yeah. So first of all before I go to the number mm-hmm. uh, we are on Facebook, Twitter and Instagram. Mm-hmm under blue gum resort yeah please like please share please subs- uh, comment and all mm-hmm. that yeah yeah tell us what you want we mm-hmm. will try make your dreams come true yeah and uh when we come to also having our website we have a website it's mm-hmm. www.bluegumresort.com wow if you want to send us an email it's uh bluegumresort@gmail.com mm-hmm. at gmail.com Yes. Wow. The phone number mm-hmm. I will give you I'll and you can screen. put it on the screen. Yes. Because yes. <laughs> I won't lie, I have yeah. not memorized that okay. thing. Okay. <laughs> it's totally fine. It's yeah. totally fine. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank so, you very much for your time. I've really had an amazing time, you know, just going uh, around this place mm-hmm. and being able to see how beautiful beautiful it is. Asante okay. sana kwa mara nyingine. And as I said, tutakuja. Thank you so much for coming. Mm-hmm. I really appreciate. Okay. And um one more thing, mm-hmm. if someone comes through you, mm-hmm. Uh, we'll give you a very special 
discount. Amazing, <laughs> amazing sana. Big shout out kwa Blue Gum Resort if you are around Rongai, Nairobi, come away ni tourist, international tourist. Tell your friends ambao pia wanatoka uh, diaspora wanataka kusemu ya kupumzika hapa nchini Kenya. Tell them to come to Blue Gum Resort. Na no, ukikuja tu sema, "Hey, by the way, I saw your interview with presenter Ali, alafu unapewa discount." It's that easy. Anyways, big shout out to director captain behind the camera, mini presenter Ali, your entertainment PA. The air is always for amazing siku zote. Uh, ukitaka kufanikiwa, uspende kusifiwa. Everything that you do, make sure it's amazing. I'll see you guys in the next episode. <laughs>